Alright, to complete this step, all you need to do is send an email to a thousand members at listeners. It's as easy as just going to send mail, typing in how many credits you want to use. In this case, I've got a thousand and eighty one. Typing in my subject line and my email body. Now, if you're a new member, most likely you don't have a thousand credits yet. So to earn credits, all you have to do is wait patiently. There are plenty of members sending mail using listeners. So once you go to your inbox, look for these messages. You can see right here, I've got a whole bunch of them. Um, there's some that say from listeners, the majority, and then others are uh, members who want to actually customize the email from their name. So right here immediately, I know Stefan Berg, so I'm going to click on his and see what it is. Wow! I have to say I'm very impressed with the way he did his email. He's even got images. Uh, you can see his photo up here. Hey Tim, wait. Lots of really good text. And the whole thing is actually a link. Which I think is great because it's there's no question where to click. So look, I'll just click on the image. And right here I'm sent to his page and you can see up here I earned five credits that's how easy it is now you can go back to your inbox and pick another one this one the flaw with mailers I'm kinda curious what the flaw is alright this is from Brad Webb and Paul and Jay let's see hmm alright this is for buckets of banners I know about this I'm gonna click on it it's actually the same thing that Stefan was uh, promoting with so you can see I earned another five credits. We make it really easy. Let's see if I can find an email with lots of links in it. Um, all right, right here there's two of them. So wow, uh, it actually popped up the video up here because I'm using Outlook and it auto does that for YouTube links. Interesting. Um, so I'm gonna click on the YouTube link and you'll see I earned five credits again right here. Um, there's also another link. Do you think I'm gonna get credits if I click on it? Let's see. Oh no, because I already clicked a link, I'm not gonna get credits twice for the same email. Now you can still click as many links as you want, but you're only gonna get credits for one link or one time per email. And it doesn't matter, I could have clicked this one first. Uh, whichever link you click, you're gonna get your credits, and then all the rest will just say, oh, you already got credits for that email, but you can keep clicking away. Now what I really like about um, list builders is you can go at your own pace. Um, I can click on these, I can check out this site, and I could literally spend all day at this website, and when I'm ready to go check out other ones, they're still in my inbox. Um, to me this is nice because, you know, I get distracted, I don't, I don't like having to, you know, always remember to do stuff so having them just in my inbox like this going at my own pace is really neat um, and that's actually how easy it is to earn credits and if you want to get back to listeners you can click the logo in any of the emails and you're here alright so now let's assume you've got a thousand credits I'll go over a little more detail on how to send an email um, by default we put all your credits in the credits box so you don't even have to fill out anything if you don't want to You'll see here people from your downline. As you start to build a downline in listeners, you can always email those people for free, no credits required. Then people from your upgrade, if you get an upgrade, which I would totally recommend, um, let's switch over there real quick. You can see for nine bucks a month, you'll get a thousand bonus prospects. Twenty nine bucks a month, three thousand bonus. So what you'll see here is that bonus will pop up here and those are people that you can mail to without using credits so if I had that nine dollar a month plan I could put in zero here and it would actually say a thousand people from my upgrade I'm sending to a thousand people and I'm not spending any credits then the thousand credits is all bonus so it's a really good idea to upgrade you can email more often and to a lot more people all right, so let's check out this email subject. Um, I'm doing a video on CTP on how to use ListDirts. Hey, guys.
New training on click track profit. Check it out. Nice tip. All right, so I'm gonna make this really fun now. Yes, I made listeners, but this little editor, I love it. I love it. It's just so simple. Looks so great. I'm gonna go with red, white text. Oops, I unselected it. Bold. New training from Click Track Profit. And then I'm going to put a link. Insert a link. And let's insert a new tab. Insert. Boom. There you go. Now, you'll see what's different about listeners and other safe lists. We don't have you put in your link at the bottom. It's actually that link right here that I put inside the HTML that'll give credits. So you can literally copy and paste emails you're using from anywhere and they're ready to go. And oh yes. P.S. I know your name is name. Creepy or cool? You decide. All right, so name variables let you insert their names. So when they get this email, for instance, if I get it, it'll say, P.S., I know your name is Tim. Creepy or cool, you decide. Um, you can even do it on the subject line up here. You can put it in there. Those techniques actually get people's attention, and I it got my attention um, a, few, eh, a few days ago. Somebody put, hey, Tim, this is really important in the subject line or something like that, and they used my name, and or no, hey Tim, this is for you. I think it was. I was. I clicked that link so quick. I'm like, man, this person sent it straight to me. And then I go, ah, they use that technique really well. So play around with it. Uh, I'll show you. I'll send the email. Doop. All right. It says we're processing. When we go to the mail history, you'll see right here. Actually, has a. That's a little bug. I I gotta fix. But uh, the date that it sent. You can see it hasn't been sent yet, but you get all the stats on how many people opened it, clicked it, etc. Um, now, for this training step, all that matters is the sent number. So, once that hits a thousand, or this number right here, email sent hits a thousand, you can uh, check this step off and move on to the next step. Um, shouldn't take you too long, and uh, enjoy it. Have fun with it. I would suggest all the emails that you really like, save them. Uh, however your email client works, save them to a folder. Because like I said, that headline really worked for me. I can't for the life of me remember what the headline was. If I had saved it to a folder, I could have used a technique like that. Maybe even the same wording or, or slightly different and uh, gotten better results for myself. So remember to save the emails at work and uh, just have fun with it. Play around with it. Try different ways different messages sending it and uh, just see the power of safe lists and of listeners.